The war in Ukraine shows no sign of stopping. Russia continued to carry out a new wave of attacks across Ukraine on January 14th, causing a lot of damage to the country's infrastructure. The West continues to pledge military aid packages to Ukraine. Most recently, the FV-430 Bulldog APC couldn't be sent to Ukraine as part of a new UK military aid package. This was stated by the UK Secretary of Defense, Ben Wallace. In addition to the Bulldog armor personnel carrier, Britain has pledged to send to Ukraine a company of Challenger 2 tanks, a battery of eight AS-90 155mm self-propelled guns. There are also dozens of drones, 100,000 rounds of ammunition, hundreds of missiles, and spare parts for our vehicles. Introduced in December 2006, the Bulldog was designed as an upgraded variant of the FV-430 APC to meet an urgent operational requirement for extra armor vehicles for use in counter-insurgency campaigns in Iraq and Afghanistan. Armor of the FV-430 was upgraded. The Mark III Bulldog was fitted with an explosive reactive armor and countermeasure jammers against improvised explosive devices. Some areas of the vehicle are fitted with sled armor for protection against anti-tank rockets. It is claimed that the FV-430 Mark III is better protected than the Warrior Infantry Fighting Vehicle. A new engine and steering gear provide better mobility and maneuverability. Other features include air conditioning and a gun station fitted with a 7.62mm machine gun that can be controlled from inside the vehicle. The modifications, as well as bringing the vehicle's level of protection up to that of the Warrior, give it better cross-country performance and a new top speed of 72 km per hour. This combat vehicle is not amphibious. However, it seems that it might be fitted with flotation kit as its predecessor. In this case, on water, it is propelled by its tracks. Overall weight became 15.3 tons. The FV430 has a crew of two and can carry eight fully equipped troops. Troops enter and leave the vehicle via the rear doors or our roof hatches.